with police officers. You know, they are meant to serve and protect the community when the community needs it the most. But are there enough officers? Over the past few years, we've told you about the struggles that police departments have faced in recruiting and keeping officers. As WCNC Charlotte's Chloe Leshner reports, the CMPD chief says recruitment and retention is going to be a top priority this year. The department has about 300 officer positions open right now, and it may get worse before it gets better. CMPD is expecting to hit a peak number of retirements in the next year or so. Nationwide, recruiting and retaining law enforcement officers has been a struggle. Major Brad Koch with CMPD thinks policing as a profession is at a crossroads. Police officers can't work from home like many others can. And Major Koch says new challenges were brought to light after the death of George Floyd. Our community expects officers to be perfect and to handle every single call um, how they would want the call to be handled. And there's a lot of second guessing and, and armchair quarterbacking, so to speak. And so that's that's a real challenge. And that's probably the biggest challenge that um, that I've seen in the profession over the last decade. It has always been a dangerous job, but as Charlotte grows, so do its problems. Homicides, armed robberies, car thefts and property crimes all up in 2022 compared to 2021. But as they recruit at job fairs and share their mission on their social media platforms, the department tries to shine a light on the positive and rewarding parts of the job. It's a really uh, gracious profession, a noble profession, as I said, and it's a really needed profession. While a big city comes with more challenging calls, they say the size of the department is what sets CMPD apart from others nearby. We have 30 different specialized units, anywhere from canine to helicopter to aviation to bomb to investigations, but we also have the ability to, um, with a dynamic uh, ability to for promotion and for advancement. Another recruitment tool, the department is offering a number of monetary incentives right now, depending on what shift somebody works, where they live, or if they even speak multiple languages. At CMPD headquarters, Chloe Leshner, WCNC Charlotte.